Well, hello, my berries. Yes, it has been a while since I have greeted you all that way. It is me, Darkberry32, y'all. As you can see, yeah, by the outfit, it's Monday. It is Monday, so... Let me tilt you guys down just a tad. Please don't mind my hands, please. Let me do it that far. Very sensitive, isn't it? Okay. So, yeah. Hello, y'all. <laughs> it's Monday, but my Monday is over, and I'm happy about it. I'm happy to be reporting to you that I did survive another Monday at work. And thank the Lord for all of that. So as you can see by my outfit, it's a bit casual for a Monday, isn't it? I hadn't done this in a while since that one morning that we were late or something like that. Where I didn't, or the outfit didn't work out. And I was like, okay, I just need something really quick. But again, have that go-to outfit when you're just not feeling it. You just don't feel, like I had a whole dress that I was going to wear. And I'm like, I don't feel like wearing no heels. Not today. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe not this week. I don't know. I just, right now, I'm not feeling it. So, I decided to don those trusty old Michael Kors ballet flat uh, shoes and my little trusty black pant from, I think, Burlington or TJ Maxx or something like that. You know, a nice, good black stretchy pant. And then this blouse is actually a blouse that was given to me by um, a good friend of mine, um, ex-co-worker we started together and i think she got this from um i want to say ann taylor loft because that was one of her favorite places to shop i know that that's one of her favorite places so yeah um i like it and i think it's it it hold this blouse is really held up i don't i haven't worn it a lot but i think i have worn it before like in the winter time time frame not winter time sorry in the summer time frame you know, with a pair of shorts, some sandals, really, really cute. I love how flowy it is. It's really good for the summer because it's very sheer and everything. I just wore like a little black um, tank top underneath, if I can find it. A little blank, little black tank top or um, cami underneath. Um, you know, be more modest at work. So yeah, this is my outfit of the day. But since you are here and if you're watching this outfit of the day, I just want to say hello and welcome. My name is Darkberry32, also known as Karen. On this channel, you're going to find a little bit of everything, y'all. You're going to find outfit of the days or outfits of the week, as you can see by the title of this video. Then you're going to find thrifting because I love to do a lot of things on a budget, decor, DIYs, organization, cooking, um, even a little makeup, hair, and all that kind of stuff. Like, truly, I know when I first started recording um, for YouTube, like I wanted to call my channel um, I'm Every Woman because I just, I like to dibble and dabble in all kinds of things. I love to have events. I also vlog. Um, so you, you're going to find any and everything. Like, just come on over to the channel. Check it out. I have all kinds of stuff. Um, I've even given advice on a lot of things, too. I used to have, um, what was it called, y'all? It was something. Yeah, I can't remember. I can't remember. But anyway, I used to, you know, do the advice and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, I think it was just Ask Darkberry. I think that's what it was called, Ask Darkberry. So, yeah, that was that's that. So, if you, that's something that you like and if you like this go ahead and smash that subscribe button because like i said we do everything on a budget over here and smash the subscribe button it's free don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you're one of the first people to actually see the video and are able to comment and say hello to me i think that is so cool like the first person that actually gets to see the video that would be cool whoever thinks they're the first person to see the video Go ahead and comment. Comment below. I would love to see like my top five people. The top five people that 
see this see my videos you know like can't wait till they come out clicks it right away and comments that would be really really cool so do that and let me know like my top one two three four five and i'll give you guys a shout out and if you have a channel i'll really shout you out and let you know so let me know um who watches but anyway y'all this is my outfit today so i'm gonna come closer and show you my makeup this is my makeup oh lord i just realized what i did but it's okay it's still recording y'all gonna see that it's gonna be a difference in um the screen because i'm recording on where i should be taking pictures <laughs> but anyway it doesn't matter i'm still recording but um yeah this is my makeup of the day um I just did a really natural look. I really, y'all, I keep talking about this mascara here. Let me show y'all, just in case there's some new people. I need to show y'all this mascara because this won't be the last time I buy it. I like the way it makes my lashes look, guys. I really, really, truly do. It's called the Falsies Surreal by Maybelline. This is it right here. Um... I think I got it from Target. This is not focusing, is it? It is not focusing. Let me do this. Maybe it'll focus if I do that. Shut up, I focus. I guess because I'm on a whole different thing. I, you know what? Hold on one second, guys. Okay, I'm back. Is that? Is this gonna be better? I don't know because of the glare, huh? Boop 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 boop. There we go. Here we go. That's it right there. Falsy Surreal by Maybelline. Okay. So, yeah. I um, love the mascara. I love what it does to the lashes. I don't know. I mean, I, I, I also feel like it's making my lashes grow, to be honest with you. But I love it. I love the, you know, kind of gives me the doe-eyed look, you know. <laughs> and then um, the hair... The hair I did it this morning on a washed uh, and dried hair, I just kind of sectioned it off, sprayed it. I know you guys are asking for a video. I know, I know. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it for you. And But I, it was a dry. Um, I had washed it yesterday, just let it air dry. And then this morning, I sectioned it off and used that three-row comb along with, this time I used the Shea Moisture um, Curling Smoothing Gel. And then also the extreme gel. And it gave me such great curls. And I'm going to tell you another thing. I hit a milestone. Because when I put that gel and stuff on my hair this morning, when it was still wet, y'all, I got to shake it. And it laid in place. And then this morning, after it started drying, I kind of did this so that it, you know, can kind of pop up here and there. So I truly, truly love the look. Look at that. Like, it is growing so much, and so I kind of picked it out. I didn't pick it out all the way. Like, I probably could get a lot more volume, but I'm just going to kind of, I, I don't know. I'm starting to really, really love the way the hair is shaping up. I'm still out on how I'm going to wear this hair going on this vacation. Because this right here, it ain't nothing like it. To me, it's freedom. It's a lot of freedom. Oh, God, it's so much freedom. But then you think about getting up in the morning and trying to do it go to the beach and all that kind of stuff but at least i know when i get home all i got to do is wash it while i'm taking a shower and then throw some product in it and i'm out the dough honey so i'm probably going, I'm going on this vacation looking just like me i'm not i am not about to braid because i told you i wouldn't put no braids in my head it's, i ain't gonna put no other hair in my head honey I don't know. I just love it. I don't. I love it, and especially now it's starting to grow. I'm trying to think how long has it been. I think I went natural in February. Well, yeah, I guess you can say natural because my hair was relaxed and then I just chopped it. So I think it was February when I went natural because I was. I still had these braid things in my head. When mom passed, and that was in December, went to the service in December with that same stuff in my head, and then I went on a cruise in January. We had a cruise that was planned, which was right on time. Oh, Lord, that was right on time, because it was just, y'all, I learned a lot about myself through that process. I don't like to be sad. Your dryer is done. Okay. 
they things be telling all our business. But anyway, um, yeah, it was so. I remember going on a cruise. I still had that in my head, and then I came back. I think it was either late January, early February, because I remember I was getting a lot of um, dental work done too when I once I got back. So. Yes, I sure did. So it had to be late January when I did that. And so what are we saying? February, February, March, April, May, June. So I've been, been, this is pretty good growth for five months. I'm not even going to lie to you because I'm going to tell you this stuff was short. If I if I can remember when I'm um, doing this, uh, editing this video, I'll try to do a side by side so you guys can see where I came from and then what I'm looking like now. So maybe I'll do a put something right here. I hope. I hope I remember to put something right here. Um so you guys can see the difference between what I'm looking like. Why does it look like it's white? Is it the lighting? Let me turn this. Maybe that's what it was, the reflection of the light. Cuz I'm like, why every time I get in this thing it look like this hair is white? I don't know, y'all. Anyway, that is it for my outfit of the day. Um, this is my makeup, um, hair, same jewelry. This time I decided to wear these loops. I don't know. You know what? I'm starting to feel myself with the big loops and the short hair. Like, I'm really starting to feel myself because y'all see I've been going to these a lot. Because at one time I was using those, those like teardrop ones with it. The, but these here, I'm starting to do them a lot. These and those gold loops. So y'all watch out. She she thinks she's getting grown because she got a little... Look at that. Look at the growth of this hair, y'all. I'm telling y'all, I can't wait for y'all to see this. Well, you probably already saw it by now. So anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Now on to Tuesday. Bye. Well, hello, my berries. <laughs> it is Tuesday and Tuesday is done. So I'm going to warn y'all right now. Tomorrow is not going to be as stressy going to be a jean day. I have some volunteering that I'm going to do um, with making, um, I'm volunteering to do like food for um, some of the, what do they call it now, like, you know, people that are kind of disadvantaged when it comes to, you know, having meals and stuff like that. And I'm doing it primarily for kids. So it's going to be a pretty cool thing to get involved in. So I'm going to be doing that. I'm going to go to work. Then I'll leave to go do some volunteering and then come back to work. So, But I'm going to put on jeans because I don't want to mess up anything dressy and I want to be comfortable and all those things. So, yes, that is it. So, for my outfit today, you guys have seen this dress before. I decided to wear it because I was, you know, yesterday I didn't look, you know, I wasn't like so dressy to say it was at the early stages of the week. So, I decided to don this dress. It's an easy dress to throw on to look cute in, I think. Um, it's a, a faux type of a wrap dress where it looks like it's being wrapped here. And what I did is underneath, I put like a, that same black cami that I had on yesterday, you know, to just kind of keep covered up. And I just love the flowiness of it. Summertime, it keeps you kind of cool. And then I paired it with these uh, shoes from Target. You guys have seen these before. So yeah, just a real easy casual. You guys know I love to get a an outfit where you just throw on a dress and you're all good to go. So I'll come up closer. You guys can see the makeup. This is the makeup, you know, nothing, just the same old stuff, y'all. <laughs> I don't even know why I do this part, but um, I think I've already done, yeah, I've done the makeup tutorial to show you guys how I do my everyday um, makeup look. And so, yes, this is it. Um, I haven't really done anything different except for I may put a little bit more eyeshadow on the lid. And all that kind of stuff. I showed you guys yesterday with the, ma the mascara that I used. Really, really like that mascara because I love the length that it gives my lashes. Um, I don't know. I just like it. To me, it gives me like a doughy, a doe-eyed look. So anyway, and then my jewelry. I just have on these loops that I got um, from the Nutcracker Market um, to kind of, you know, kind of go with. I feel like this is a really boho-ish type of, you know, look or whatever. So yeah, this is it. This is my outfit of the day, y'all. I hope you liked it. So I'm gonna go downstairs because dinner is waiting for me. And oh, and the hair. <clears throat> 
The only thing that I did with my hair is um, just kind of picked it out a little bit, added a little water to make it easier to pick out. But that's pretty much it. The curls are really holding really well. I, I think I told y'all yesterday, I made up my mind that I'm going to wear my hair like this uh, on the vacation. I'm not. Um, this is it. This is it. I've made up my mind. No one can change. I, want, I like to see y'all try to change. Well, y'all won't even. Yeah, y'all have a chance. No, you won't. No, because when this uh, video goes up, I will be on vacation when this video goes up. So, yeah. Anyway, this is it. I shall talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. Hey, y'all. And there's Chef. <laughs> so, today is Wednesday. And my Wednesday is done. Thank God. So, we can move on to Thursday and hope that Thursday is better. Isn't that right, little pumpkin boy? Little pumpkin boy. We need orange baby. And this is mama. I, we just got home, guys. We just got home. So, at 7 o'clock, I might be missing a show, but we'll see. Um, but real fast, let me just... Chef, can I tell the people what I'm wearing? Can I tell the people what I'm wearing? Hmm? You miss me? Did you miss me? Y'all, me and this cat. Me and this cat. I love you so much. Okay. So, I told you I was going to go kind of casual today because um, I did some volunteer work today. Um, and I wore this just to look a little bit more professional in the office. But then when we went and did volunteer work, I took the jacket off. So that way I was more comfortable. We packed up um, some packages of jambalaya um, for U.S. hunger. So that was pretty cool. I'd never done that before. And it was really awesome to give back. So did that. Met some people that I've never uh, met in um, the company that I work for. So that was pretty cool too. So made some connections and I thought that was awesome. So let me just tell you what I have on today. I have on my Adidas. God, I'm sitting here on floors. Y'all remember that? So yeah, I got on my Adidas, the burgundy with gold, and then just a pair of Levi's, a t-shirt that I think I got from Old Navy, I think. I think it was Old Navy. I'm not sure and then of course this jacket that I got from the thrift store and I did it to pair it with the Adidas you know with the burgundy and then there's a little bit of burgundy and roses in here and then speaking of roses I wore the rose quartz perfume from Marshall's that I showed you guys before in some past videos um it was perfect because I had on the roses and I just you know you know you girl I just gotta go with some type of thing and then of course this is my makeup here it's the same same I put on my gold thin Michael Kors uh, earrings to pair it all together and just kind of, you know, y'all know my thing. I, I like to keep it classic. I like to keep a classic look. I, I want to be able to look back a few years and say, oh, okay, it wasn't so bad. Because I can look back at some of my other outfit of the days and I was like, okay, you was trying to keep up with somebody in the trends or whatever. I don't know. Because I was doing a whole lot, a lot of with all the jewelry and the thing and the makeup, honey. It was a whole lot. But I was younger. I was younger. So anyway, guys. This is it. This is my look. Um, I'm wearing my blessed ring on this finger. I don't know why all of a sudden my thumb is acting kind of mm, like it's swollen or something. I'm like, what's... You know, it looks kind of big, but I don't know. I mean, it's not hurting or anything, but I don't know. It's just like fingers are getting... Man, I'm gaining weight or something. I need to check myself. I would say check yourself before you wreck yourself. Oh, oh, let me show you guys the burgundy. See, this is the burgundy in the shoes, and it has the gold right there. Oh, yeah. Kind of cute. That's what I had on today. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Now, let's get on to Thursday, please. Please, please. I'm ready for Thursday. Bye. Well, hello, y'all. It is Thursday. And what a Thursday it has been. It is... What time is it? It is 7.39. We are just now getting home. All kinds of things. All the things. Anyway. Um, <laughs> but I'm here still making this video. I'm going to go downstairs and get something to eat, get some dinner, and get ready for Friday and the weekend. And I love how, it's so crazy how you wake up on a Monday and you're like, oh my God. And then it's like, before you know it, it's Friday again. So yeah, so like next week this time, I will actually be in Florida with some girlfriends and I cannot wait. I am ready to go lay down on somebody's beach, have some type of drinks and no responsibility for at least three days. So yeah, it's gonna be great.
But anyway, right now, I wanted to show you guys what I decided to wear. I started to almost wear this with a pair of sneakers and then settled against it and went on and got, you know, my little tried and true, my black ballet flats from Michael Kors, got those. And then I got this dress. Um, this dress came from a store called K&G here in Houston. I don't know if you guys are familiar with that, but it's mostly like suits for men, but they actually have clothes in there for women. And then, you know, dresses and slacks and you just really nice stuff. So I was quite surprised. I thought I wouldn't get anything out of that store when we went. I think it was like last year or so. And actually didn't. I really, really like it. I think it's kind of cute. It comes with a little leather, faux leather belt. And then like the little silver little decor at the end of the belt. So yeah, that is it. And I don't even know what I'm looking like. Honey, because I see y'all friend behind me. Okay, I look, I still look pretty good to say that, you know, I've been doing all kinds of crazy stuff today after work. But yeah, this is it. This is my outfit of the day the hair, the makeup. I have on these earrings. You know what? I don't even know why. And I bet y'all probably saying the same thing. Like, why don't she just downsize with the jewelry that she, because I wear the same jewelry pretty much all the time, but it's such a classic and tried and true. And I don't need anything with color when you have a metal. I don't know. Y'all tell me what y'all think, like for real. Tell me what y'all think about all, me wearing the same type of jewelry all the time. I do love a good classic look, but you know, I guess I could switch it up. But you know, when you go to work, oh, here comes y'all friend Kayla. Um, when, when you go to work, like you, you know, there ain't no need for a whole bunch of bunch of stuff. You know what I mean? So anyway. This is it, y'all. I'm going to go downstairs and give me something to eat. I shall talk to you all on Friday. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Well, hello, my berries. It's me. Yes. I, it is 9.26 at night, and I'm just now showing you guys my outfit of the day. I'm so sorry. But, um, guess I should just let everybody know. I just bought myself a new car. <laughs> so... That is why I am late filming this. It was time to give up the other one. And yes, I got a new vehicle. So, yes, yes, yes. So I'm excited. Um, but anyway, I, I was like, oh my God, it's so late. But I was like, I was getting ready to undress. And I was like, Kayla, I haven't done my outfit today. So I thought I'd come up here real fast and show you guys what I'm wearing. So today, I this was Friday, you know, at work. And so I just donned some white Adidas sneakers. Um, this skirt that I got from the thrift store. And I'm going to tell you, I was about to take this off. That's why I'm about looking quite tacky. Um, so, thrift store, Walmart, thrift store. And I really like this shirt because of the way it's kind of pleated. Here, I'll kind of show you guys. In the back, and there's y'all's friend. And he's got to come in here and be nosy. He heard me talking, so he's like, Mama, who are you talking to? So, it's a very casual, really cute, comfortable. I'm starting to try to venture out a little bit more with just the stuff that I like. This may not be everybody's cup of tea. Somebody will probably look at this and like, girl, boo, what you were thinking? I don't know. I love that. Kayla actually helped me pick it out too because we love the dark blue that was in here. Chef. <laughs> Why you got to lay in front of everything? Chefy. What are you doing? Okay. I'll just stay there then, baby. That's fine. You all right? Are you okay? When I tell you this is a character right here, this cat is a character. But I love him. But anyway, so yeah, we picked this out together um, last night. I was like, I want something cool. I was actually looking for some blue jeans, you know, but I'm like, you don't always have to wear blue jeans to be comfortable. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just a thing. You know, you feel like, oh, Friday's here. I'm wearing blue jeans. But look, I still had on a did on top. And this was cute and comfortable. And then right after work, we went over to the dealership, got the car put the down payment, pick the keys, and then we came back to the house for a little bit. Kayla met us here. We went to Olive Garden. I didn't take my camera. I'm so sorry. But we went to Olive Garden. Just I had soup, salad, bristics. <laughs> Earl has spaghetti and meatballs. Kayla had a slice of cheesecake. It was very low-key. 
and Diet Coke. Diet Coke was so good. So yeah, and that is it. So tomorrow, um, I'm hanging out with my girlfriend, Teresa, and her husband, Ray. So I'm really excited for that. Um, so you guys will see that in the vlog for this week. You'll see that in the vlog. So now I'm just going to warn y'all next week is probably going to be a different story. I'll try to get the videos out, but it might be a different story because I, like I told y'all, I'm going on a trip. And so to get back into town because I get back into town on Sunday and I go right back to work on Monday and it's going to be a long week. So I will try my best to get those videos up for y'all for, you know, um, next next week so no worries no worries I'll try my best if I can I can if I can't I'm not gonna stress myself because I'm going on vacation to get some R and R so yeah but this is it y'all this is my um, outfit today I really really liked it and go and get you guys some of these tanks I really like them I like that that it's ribbed um really good fabric Walmart I think I got them I can't remember they weren't they weren't very costly though because I got a bunch of colors I got like brown black pink white yellow i think i got pink maybe i didn't get pink i don't know but anyway I, I highly recommend these and then like i said thrift store thrift store do not skip on your thrift store I haven't been in a while because i need to purge my closet but i haven't been in a while so this is what's left of my makeup let me turn this down so you guys can see my makeup i don't want to make it too bright here we go this is my makeup look you can see i done ate it all but I feel like for the most part, I look halfway decent. Okay, let me turn it up a little bit. Let me do this. Let's see. I'm trying to, I don't want this to get in the way. But, okay, that just got in the way. I knew it would. Okay, but anyway, this is what my makeup is looking like. Like, I don't need a lot of light when it comes to showing my makeup, do I? It goes completely off. But this is it. And then I have on my silver loops to tie in with my chain. Y'all yeah, know. Finally got my blessed ring back on my thumb. Everything is good. Yeah. So this is this is it. I'm going to get my nails done on Sunday, y'all, for the trip. I'm not sure if I'm going to stick with this because I love this. It's a nice classic look. Um, I don't know if I'm going to stick with this or if I'll go with a fun color. I don't know yet. But I want to have fun. I want to have fun with my girlfriends. So anyway, that is it. That is my outfit of the day. The fragrance I wore is that Jimmy Choo. Now, I'm going to tell y'all right now. That Jimmy Choo, I want you forever. I think that's what it's called. I want you forever. Y'all, I've been getting so many compliments. Let me tell y'all something real fast. I'm going to tell y'all something. Yesterday, we was in that dealership. The salesman, right in front of my husband, was like, Oh my God, you smell so good. And he was like, oh, no disrespect, no disrespect. But he was like, you smell amazing. And I was like, it's the Jimmy Choo. I've gotten it from women, different women. I'll stand by them like, oh my God, you smell so good. Oh my God, what do you have on? Jimmy Choo. Jimmy Choo, I want you forever. Go ahead and get yourself a bottle or something. So yeah, that is it. Oh yeah, y'all recommend some perfumes for me because I'm always looking for a nice, good bottle of perfume that I can kind of splurge on here and there. So give me uh, some suggestions or whatever. So maybe I can go out and give me another bottle. How about that? All right. So that is it for Friday. On to Saturday. Bye bye. Well, hello, my berries. It's me, Dark Baby 32, and today is Monday. So I'm going to make this really fast because it's 521 and I have a nail appointment at 6. Luckily, it's only like 10 minutes up the road, but I wanted to go come on home and try to do this outfit of the day and then maybe change into something a little bit more comfortable to go get my nails and toes done because you know I'm getting ready for a vacay for the end of the week. So yeah, but yeah, guys, really, really fast. Let me show you the shoes that I am wearing. I'm wearing these shoes. I got these from, I think, Burlington or something like that. Just a cute little slide on. I've had these for a while, as you can tell. I haven't worn them lately, but I used to wear them all the time. And they're such a good heel, especially for the summertime when you don't want to, you know, have your feet all hot and everything. And I've also had this dress for a while. Like, when I say 10 plus years, 10 plus years. And I think... I think I got it from like Target or something like that. 
But I feel like it's a timeless type of dress. What do you guys think? I think it's cute and flirty or whatever. Um, it covers you enough, you know, at work. And then, you know, it just kind of gives you that cute little touch. And along with these shoes, I just think it works perfectly. So, yeah. That's my outfit. It sees me. I'm chewing gum. I shouldn't be. I'm so sorry. And then um, I just put on these gold earrings. Left in the little silver um, balls here. On my second hole. And then this is my makeup from this morning. I kind of, you can tell, I kind of eaten some of the lipstick off. But this is it. This is my outfit. Loving the hair with um, the black extreme gel that I use. It's holding really well and I love the way it makes my hair look. So I'm going to continue to use this along with the Aunt Jackie. Oops. That was weird. Oh, I was like, what is that noise? I guess people, they're dumping gravel or shoveling gravel out the back of their truck. And I was like, all I heard was bump, bump, bump. Okay, so anyway, Aunt Jackie don't shrink with the black gel. And even this morning, y'all, I didn't spray any water in my hair. I just tried to pull at it. I put a little oil, sprayed oil, and then just kind of puffed it out a little bit so I wouldn't disturb the curls that much because I know when I try to refresh it with water then cer certain areas um, get bothered and then the curls detangle and it start you know you'll start having those little fluffy spots and stuff so I kind of like just kind of keeping the curl I'm gonna try it again tomorrow and see I just slept on a silk pillowcase and then just picked it out this morning and I loved it so yes that is my outfit today I hope you guys enjoyed it I enjoyed bringing it to you and just FYI for me on this channel you're gonna get a little bit of everything guys so let me just tell you what you're gonna get okay for absolutely free this is what you're gonna get you get vlogs you get outfits of the week you get cooking you get DIYs you get decor you get shopping thrifting everything on a budget over here and then hauls it's like everything over here on this channel like it's this is entertainment central dogberry 32 is entertainment central so if this is something that you think you would like go ahead and subscribe because i'm sure there's going to be some type of video that i'm going to put on this channel that you guys are going to like so go ahead and subscribe like share you know sharing is caring and my name is karen so why wouldn't you share all right so we're going to move on to tuesday guys have a fabulous rest of your day or night or whenever you're watching okay Hey y'all, it's me and it's Tuesday, Tuesday, and y'all see what I got on, it ain't much of nothing, to be honest, I mean, it's a nice semi-professional outfit of the day, I guess you can say, I have on my flats, and the reason why, like y'all know, this is vacation week for me, I'm just like, I wish y'all should have, wish you should have about this vacation, but it is. And so tomorrow I'm working from home. So I want it to be dressy but very casual today. So I have on those Michael Kors ballerina flats. And then I have on these pants that I got from a thrift store. It was the cottage thrift store here in Houston. They have fantastic items for really, really good prices. So that's what I have. And then I have on also, where did I get this from? Oh, I'm drawing a blank. I am drawing a blank. Where did I? This was this also a thrifted? I think this was a thrifted blouse as well. I don't know. I can't remember. I really can't remember where I got this from. That's odd. But I can't remember. But anyway, it's just a nice bright gold yellowish gold our, um, blouse and then my makeup this is my makeup like we've already eaten dinner and everything I went we went and had some sushi or I had sushi and he had something else but yeah this is it and then the hair y'all I'm telling you is so working that I don't spray water on it in the morning in the morning I just kind of pick it out with my fingers then I get another pick and just go to the roots to keep the integrity of all of these curls and I am loving it with that black extreme like look how defined these curls still are so yeah I'm loving it I don't know if I'm gonna redo it 
in time to go on the trip i'm not sure i probably should just so that it'll last really good so i might do that um i hear y'all's friend in the background i don't know where he is there he is <laughs> but yeah anyway um so this is it this is my outfit this is my makeup i did the teardrop earrings again with the little balls here um in my second hole and then just my regular jewelry that I always do. And I always make sure I zhuzh up the sleeves. And then today I did wear Jimmy Choo again. Love, 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 love that perfume. So yeah, that is it. On to hump day. Hump day. Hump day, hump day, hump day. On to hump day, y'all. Bye. Well, hello my berries, it's me, Darkberry32, and I know it's been a long time, almost at least a month since I've done Outfit of the Days. I have some already in queue, and I just did not, y'all, I'm trying to, Lord, I'm rest, there's so much going on. But anyway, y'all, I don't even have shoes on because I took my shoes off before I left the office. Let me just show y'all what shoes I had on. Y'all know my trusty and true. I just had on these today. These are the ones that I got from Marshalls. <sighs> mm. I thank God for my job. I really, truly, truly do. But you know, there's just some days or weeks that it just gets to you. But I thank God that I have gone through Monday and everything is fine. And I'm living to see another day and I'm happy about that. So today I just went on and donned my uh, pleated skirt. Both this entire outfit is from the thrift, from a thrift store, different thrift stores, but nevertheless, the, this outfit was thrifted. So this is some of those things that you can just, you know, you, you go in there, you find pieces, they work together. You know what I mean? Like you can save money in so many ways. And then these shoes were on the clearance rack. So that just showed you how I do things on a budget. And since I'm talking about things that I do on a budget, I just want to let you guys know Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for tuning in first and foremost. Secondly, I want to let you know what I do here on this channel. If you're just tuning in for the very first time, you're like, who is this girl? What does she do? Why is she sitting up here telling us about her thrifted clothes? Well, on this channel, you're going to get a little bit of everything. You're going to get thrifting, cooking, DIY, decor, hauls, vlogs. You're going to get it all on this channel. I like to do a little bit of everything. So you're going to get that on this channel. There's no telling what you're going to get. I try to upload at least two, maybe three videos a week. If I can, if possible, there are times that I do need to take a break. And I just took a break when I went on vacation. By the way, that video is up and running where I went on vacation with two of my girlfriends from the uh, military. I former Air Force. Um, I'm married. I got four kids two bonus daughters and a son and a daughter of my own biologically and so yeah that is my life in a nutshell and since i was talking about bargains that's what you get on this channel so if you have not subscribed and this sounds like something that you would like then go ahead and hit the subscribe button because like i said i do everything on a budget and to subscribe is free so why wouldn't you just go ahead and hit the button i mean it's free right and go ahead and go back and watch all the videos um, one thing that is new here, um, my husband and I moved in this house uh, back in January 2022. So you can go back and look at where we built the house. Like we would come out and, you know, film, you know, the progress of the house. And we also filmed the first night that we came in and the house was ours and we actually put the key in the door. Um, we actually filmed, I have filmed all kinds of decor around the house. So just just so much there's so much so much so much and then i do a lot of vlogging and things like that so yeah and then the latest is my daughter kayla is a school teacher and kayla has been on my channel for forever since she was you know i think probably elementary and um she is now a third grade school teacher and i want to thank all of you guys that gave and went to her her uh amazon list and purchased so many things. Um, okay, Nicole. Oh gosh, I'm trying to think of the names. Oh, I, I feel so bad. Wait, I know. I can do it right here because I have it right here. Um, let me go here, here. Because I know how to do this now. And I can tell you exactly who um, donated to her if 
my phone would connect. Okay, let's see. Because I know it was Ingrid. Ingrid. Ingrid, girl, you did your thing. Ingrid, I-N-G-X-S on YouTube. You did your thing. Like, she just kept opening her packages. This is from Ingrid. This is from Ingrid. I'm like, what? You did your thing. And I think you were the one that reminded me that I did not put the link. So I knew that you were going to buy something, but I didn't think you was going to buy all of that. So we really, really appreciate y'all's support. Iris, Iris, thank you so much. I mean, you guys don't even understand how excited she was to get these packages and knowing that this is going to go towards her classroom and, you know, like, um, oh, and then I'll fill y'all in on probably some of the things that she's going to end up doing with these things. And Nicole, I've already mentioned Nicole. So Ingrid, I was Nicole. And just yesterday, I got another package here at my house because I had everything shipped here. I told her to just put my address so that way at her apartment, she won't have any mix-ups. We know it's going to be on my front porch. she come get it. And Sasha Monique Talks, we actually got a package from you yesterday, and she was actually looking for those. She was like, oh, I hope somebody buys the fruity um, granola bars, and you came in in a clutch. So she was really excited about that. So let me tell you, so her first week in school, so basically her class, they end up getting thumbs ups. Like other teachers will see them behaving, and they give them thumbs ups, and then they get to count those thumbs ups. Well, her class is one of the first classes to finish and get all the thumbs ups that they needed to gain a party. So this is probably some of the things that she's going to use for that party for, for other parties in the future. Cause this past party they had, um, they voted to do a pajama party and she did goldfish for that party. And so, um, I think it was, um, Ingrid that bought her more goldfish. One of y'all bought her a bunch, a bunch of goldfish. She was excited about that. So I know she's, she's using all this stuff for her classroom. So we really, really do appreciate all that. And I know this is an outfit of the day and I just went on a tangent and I'm so sorry. But I had to, had to, had to thank you guys because you guys are those loyal subscribers that are always, always commenting on my video. And then y'all are doing a crusade where y'all are actually trying to get me monetized. And I am so grateful for that. Like, I have been on YouTube for a long time, as most of you know, a long time. And I used to be monetized a long time ago, and then YouTube decided to change everything. And now they're telling you you have to get at least 4,000 hours in, 360, in a 365 day period. Well, I'm really close. I'm like 3,184. So, and I know some of you guys are actually going on and watching my videos, and you're even commenting on past videos that you hadn't seen. And I really do appreciate it. And I would love to ask others to do the same. I mean, if, if I get monetized, then that money can go towards better and more videos for you guys and whatever you ask for. I mean, you guys have been loyal to the, I mean, to donate stuff for my daughter, to spend your own money. I just think that's awesome because I never ask for money from you guys. Like, I know some people, they get, I don't know, it's the stuff that they get. I don't know. It's some kind of thing that people donate money to them or something. I don't do that kind of stuff. But I really do appreciate you guys helping her out with her being unemployed for, you know, before she got this job. And then she doesn't get her check for another like month or so. So this actually helped her out um, getting her started. She's been working so hard, studying, passing her tests, taking tests, all that kind of stuff. And for her to get this job, it was just amazing because this is what she wanted to do. And she actually told my mom she wanted to do. So my mom got to know what she wanted to do before she passed away. I lost my mom back in December of uh, 2022, which was so crazy. Like 2022 was 2022 was a bitter sweet type of year because it started out with us getting this home which was awesome i remember calling my mom and telling her mom you know because i told her i was going to come to her house that night and i actually we went and signed for the papers and i remember calling her and saying mom i can't make it tonight i ain't gonna be able to come to your house and she was like oh okay what's going on? I said, well, I just signed papers for my brand new house. So we got to go to my new house. And she was like, what? Oh my God. And she just, I could hear her screaming over the phone and she's telling her husband like, Hey, we got the, they got the house. They got the house. We're coming over. We're coming over. We're coming over. So they came over that night and she was just so excited for me. And then we ended the year in December and she's gone. And it was just like, 
Like she didn't even make it to Christmas, and it just hurt. It broke my heart. Of course, it broke my heart because I I miss my mom. But it broke my heart because Christmas, the holidays, that's what we do. That's what me and her used to do. And she didn't even get to celebrate Thanksgiving because she wasn't feeling well. So it was a bittersweet. But I know she's up in heaven and she's working. She is working overtime for her grandkids. Let me just tell you because this is not the only grandkid that has been blessed, honey. She is getting them all in. I'm telling you, she's getting them all in. So I... Yeah, so that's, I don't know why I'm saying all this. I guess because if you're new, then you kind of get a little background on what's going on. But anyway, I digress. So y'all saw my outfit, and then I'm just going to show you guys my makeup. Hair is growing like crazy. I am steady drinking, um, well, let me tell y'all another thing. So I am drinking collagen in my coffee in the morning when i was drinking coffee in the morning i'll come back to that and then i'm also taking multivitamins like women's vitamins for hair and all that kind of stuff because i cut my hair back in february of this year it was very short it was probably about this short y'all i ain't gonna lie it was short and now it has grown tremendously but y'all know how it is the shrinkage is real i gotta go through the process honey and um yeah so that is it so Going back to the college and stuff. And then I'm going to get off because I know this is like 10 minutes already for one outfit of the day. So, I don't know. Anyway, y'all, I'm trying to intermittent fast. And I'm telling y'all that so y'all can hold me to it. I started today. And so, my schedule for eating is 2 to 10. I know y'all like, 2 to 10? Yes, because your girl likes to lay in bed or sit on the couch and watch her shows prime time and eat her some snacks no matter what it is i want to be able to eat me some snacks that's just my thing and i'm catering to how my schedule fits for me yes i have to go almost to two i do i go today i went to 1 30 only because we had a meeting at two and so i was like let me go ahead and put something in my mouth so i had like grapes bananas some almonds and then i had some leftover queso and chips and that was it that's all i had today and then of course i did my walk i have 11,998 steps, so almost 12,000 steps today. And so, um, I, I gained five pounds, but I want to get more than five pounds off of me, of course. It ain't gonna, you know, so I'm, I'm trying to get more than five pounds. I want to try to get at least 10 to 15 if I can. 10, 10, if I got 10 pounds, 15 pounds, honey, yeah, I'll be doing real good. So, that's what I'm trying to do for myself. And I'm intermittent fasting to do that. And then I'm also walking. I'm not counting calories per se. But I'm I'm keeping my, my blood sugar will stay down. And then that would help me, you know, kind of lose some of this weight. Especially here in the midsection here in my belly. I definitely need to lose this midsection, honey. Because it's just doing its own thing today. I just, I don't know. But it, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. We're going to live. Hopefully to see another day if God says the same. So, yes, y'all, that is it. And then here's my jewelry. Y'all, I took some of my, y'all remember, I took some of them off. I just thought it was looking kind of, hmm. So, the only ones that I have on now is um, a bracelet that one of my girlfriends that I was in the military with that gave me this for, you know, the passing of my mom. And then I always got to keep the cross near me. <laughs> you know. And then this is the bracelet that I brought my mom, um, I think it was couple of birthdays ago and this is what she had on her when she was really ill and sick and never went back home so this is the last one of the last pieces of jewelry she had on her and so now it is on me and I don't want to take it off and then this is a bracelet that my daughter got me for Christmas that speaks to me about my mom how I have an angel in heaven and it's my mother and then my sister-in-law Yaki Got me this for Mother's Day a long time ago, honey. I've never taken that off either. So this is what I have on. And then on this arm, my dupe Van Cleef that I got from Marshalls. And then my Fitbit watch. And then these are my Michael Kors um, earrings. And this necklace that I got from Zales a long time ago that I don't ever take off. So this is my jewelry. You guys, if you're new, you'll find out that I'll pretty much wear the same type of jewelry over and over again. I like a good loop, gold or silver. Um, I don't venture out with like costume jewelry per se i don't know i just like a real classic look i want to be able to look back on my pictures and like okay yeah that that she's still she's still she's still good you know what i'm saying <laughs> so anyway guys i hope you enjoyed this now on to tuesday bye hey y'all it's me it's tuesday so let me step back and show you guys what i'm sporting today 
yeah, I don't know where that song came from. I just, I don't know. Don't y'all forgive me. <laughs> so today is Tuesday. And my Tuesday is done. So now I get to go on to Wednesday. But anyway, I wanted to show y'all. I decided to try to, I don't know, mix it up a little bit with my wardrobe. So you guys have seen these pants, this shirt, and even this shirt before. Um... This, these pants are from Amazon. I will do the link down below so you guys can get in on this. They have them in all colors. They don't have them just in black. And I think I really like, because I think I ended up getting these. How many colors? It's just three colors I think I got. I know I got black. I know I got like a green and like a yellow. I need to go back and get some more because I really like them. I like the um, how comfortable they are but still dressy at the same time and like if i wanted to wear sneakers with this it would absolutely go because like um at work i walk you know for exercise i put my sneakers on um there's a tunnel system um here in houston downtown so i put my sneakers on and i walk the tunnels honey and it looks just as good so you know so you can wear sneakers with this if you want to and, and like really um dress it down like you want to put a, a t-shirt or a graphic tee with this or whatever and wear some sneakers easily easily you can do that um and like i said they have them in all kinds of colors and then i also got this blouse also from amazon that i absolutely love i got this one in a pink as well and i absolutely love this shirt and as a matter of fact one of my coworkers was like oh go ahead girl with your um they thought i had on like a jumpsuit and i'm like nope it's two pieces and they were like, oh, really? And I was like, I'll send you the link. So I'll put the link down below for both for both pieces, the, the top and um, the pants. Like I said, you don't have to get this color. They have all different types of colors. And then as far as the uh, shirt underneath, here, I'll come up a little closer so you guys can see. It's just a brown tank. I got it from Walmart. I think it was like three bucks, two to three dollars um, from Walmart. So I decided to just pair this all together. And what was the inspiration for this outfit, you may say? It was, it was the shoes. Here, let me see if I can do this. It was the shoes. And where did I get these shoes from? I'm gonna show them up close to you guys. I got these shoes from Goodwill. They are a Jacqueline Smith brand. And I think Jacqueline Smith, I think Jacqueline, was, Jacqueline Smith was Walmart at one time, I think. But yeah, love, you know, I don't know if I've ever told you guys that, but I love a good Mary Jane. And this is a good shoe to walk downtown in those tunnel systems because I park far and I have to walk about a good 15 minutes and it does not bother my feet at all. If anything, I could have used maybe like those, um, you know, the cushioning inside of them, you know, that type of thing. But here, I'll show you guys up close what this shoe looks like, y'all. Absolutely love, love a good Mary Jane one. You can slip it on, slip them off. This is the shoe, isn't it? I don't know. <laughs> I may be telling my age or whatever, but I love a good Mary Jane. I just think, I don't know, like a throwback to your childhood, but then kind of classy at the same time. Y'all have to comment below and tell me what you think about these shoes. Because I absolutely love these shoes. When I saw them, I just did not want to leave them. But yeah, Jacqueline Smith, that's the brand right uh, there you go, right there. Really good pair of shoes. And I think I paid like maybe eight bucks for these shoes at the Goodwill. I really, truly, truly love these shoes, y'all. And I could not wait to wear them. I was like, I've had them for a while. I've had them sitting here in this office for a while, but I was just like, I don't know what to wear. And then the other day I was like, oh, I have those shoes. I can wear those shoes with these pants. And I just put this tank to kind of, you know, coordinate a little bit. So yeah, this was my outfit of the day. Today, I don't have on loops. Can y'all believe it? I mean, this is sort of like a loop. So, yeah, I just have on these gold earrings and then my normal um, jewelry. These are my James Avery rings. Let me see. Can y'all see that? I love wearing this ring. So, yeah, my James Avery ring, my wedding ring, my watch, my bracelets, all the things. Same stuff every day. Y'all know me. Only thing that really changes up is my earrings. And I didn't put my second earring in this morning. Kind of was running late, so I decided not to. I'm trying to take this shoe off. This other shoe off. All right. So, yeah. This is it. This is my outfit of the day. Um, hair. 
I decided to kind of do the little roughness instead of, you know, cur having the curls. I, I like doing this because it's like I can wear it where my hair is kind of stretched. And I feel like when I actually do those curls, like my hair is like, you know, which I mean, I don't mind either way. But today I decided to do the rough kind of look and stuff like And I mean, look how my hair is really growing. So, yeah, but y'all know what it is, the shrinkage. Shrinkage is real when it comes to natural hair, but that's okay. Eventually, one day, I'm going to have some some movement with my hair. One day. Today ain't the day, though. Today is not the day. So, yeah, I want to say, look, let me just give, every, give you guys a shout out. I have, like I, I think I told you, I have a few subscribers out there that are bumping up my hours and y'all I appreciate y'all so much I appreciate appreciate y'all so much especially um what is it what is it's Mo I should know your name because I've been commenting on stuff all day today because she's been watching my videos all day today Mo over there Mo over there has been doing her thing over here on this channel because she has been watching like old videos and commenting and I appreciate you so much and she even said that like I'm her extended family and it just made me feel so good like that knowing that you know sometimes when you're on this side of the camera you're thinking okay you're doing it for yourself but then you don't know how you are affecting other people on the side so I'm so happy that you know, I feel like I'm her virtual family, you know, and she's telling me about my house and all the things and stuff like that. So I love it. Mo over there. Let's see what she said now. Let me see. What video is this? Oh, it's a shot with me at IKEA plus IKEA and a Goodwill haul. Oh, she was just thanking me for sharing because I'd already commented on one of her comments. So yeah. I just think it's so cool. It is so cool. Like, I mean, let me just show y'all real fast. Let me see if y'all can focus. Let me see if we can focus on that. But look. Look. Look at her. She's just... She's just... She's just supporting me. So, I mean, like, big time supporting. It's crazy. And then, um, Iris, I hope you saw the shout out that I did to you, Nicole, and Ingrid. All y'all. And um, Sasha Monique Talks. I had to do yours separate, Sasha, because your stuff came in after theirs. But I hope y'all saw that on my community page. Let me know if y'all can see my community page. Do y'all even know what that is? Because, like, you know, some people, it's almost like a um, Facebook portion of um, YouTube. So y'all let me know if y'all see it or not. And let me see how many hours. Because... Before she did this, I think I had 3,144 hours. Ooh. Ooh, girl, you're doing it for me. I have 3,196 hours. And if all of y'all was to do that and not leave it up to Mo, <laughs> this would be great. Oh, my God. I hope, I'm hope i hoping like so soon that I will hit that 4,000th hour. It would be remarkable. Then I can start monetizing, which would be great for a change. And then, y'all tell me what y'all think. I'm going to say this and I'm going to get off. Because I know this ain't number for all for the days. But this is also our chatting time. This is our chat time. But I need y'all's uh, advice on this. So, I know sometimes you got, some of you have come to me like, are you getting sponsorships and da 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 And I've had people reach out to me. Quite a few. But I don't respond to them per se. Because... I don't have a P.O. box. I don't want them people. Like, what if they're fake? And then I give them. I'm not going to give them my real address. And so, y'all let me know if I should go ahead and just get a P.O. box. And then I think. I just don't know if I have a good enough following where, you know, I start getting stuff and then you know, you guys will be interested in this stuff. Because, like, I've had people reach out to me about coffee makers and jewelry. And, and I'll, I just ignore it. Like, because I don't, and I need to look into how much it is to get a P.O. box. And then just do it, you know, and then see what happens. You know, like, maybe I'll go through my email and see if I have. And then get the P.O. box, respond to these people, and see about what, what could possibly happen. And if it's not a big following, then I can always just say no to the P.O. box, right? So, 
I'm thinking about doing it. So y'all tell me what you think. So I'm going to leave you with that. So that's y'all's homework. To let me know what you think. Um, I know some of you that watch me, I'm sure you have your own YouTube channels. And that's another thing. Let me know if y'all have your own YouTube channel. I'll shout y'all out because I know the struggle. The struggle is real on this side of the camera. When you really want people to watch your content and your name isn't out there. I have 2,100 followers and I will let all of them know about you if you want me to. But also because you are... Um, YouTubers, do you have sponsorships? Did you end up getting a, a P.O. box and all that stuff? So let me know, y'all. This is going to be a long video. All right. I will talk to y'all later on to Wednesday. Bye. Hey, y'all. It's Wednesday. It's hump day. Hump day. Hump day. Hump day. Hump day. It's hump day, y'all. And I have made it through hump day. That means tomorrow's Thursday and I'm excited about it. So yes, 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 today is hump day. I decided to go really kind of, you know, semi-casual. I mean, still works for the office. So I went semi-casual and I'm glad I did because we had an impromptu pizza party, which was a lot of fun. And I had to do a lot of running around and all things and stuff like that. So this was a good outfit to wear. I bought this dress. Y'all know what I'm gonna say <laughs> from a thrift store. I think it's J. Crew. It's a good, nice brand. So, again, know your brand. So when you go into these stores, you'll know what to get. get. You'll get some good quality pieces. Again, you don't have to spend an arm and a leg to have good quality pieces. So, got this from J. Crew, and then I paired it with these shoes here. I actually went to the outlet, um, ooh, a while back. Um, at uh, the Michael Kors uh, outlet store and I got these and I thought this would be something really cute to go with this so I decided to wear I don't hardly ever wear these shoes and so decided to put them on today really enjoyed wearing them and then so because the Michael Kors emblem in the back is gold I decided to pair it with a pair of um, my Michael Kors gold loops they're really really thin I saw Nene Leaks a long, long time ago on the Housewives wear some thin ones, and that's and I've had them ever since. So love I like I was like I'm gonna get those. I don't know where I'm gonna get them, but I'm gonna get something that's really, really barely there type of a loop. Um, I just think I don't know. I just like them because they were like they make a statement without making a statement. I don't know. But anyway, that's what I wore, and then. Regular jewelry, regular jewelry, and look, my lip is different. I just um, kind of lined it with some of that uh, Revlon Lip Color Stay ink, and then I wore a gloss today. Um, I'll put a little extra on for y'all because, of course, you know, it kind of rubbed off during the day, but I'll put a little extra on just so y'all can see what I was looking like this morning, and just kind of defined the part a little bit. Even in the back, I kind of edged myself up a little bit in the back. So yeah, that's it for Wednesday. I got to get going because I got to cook dinner and um, just kind of relax. I'm a little tired. I'm not tired, but I could use some rest and some water, to be honest with you right now. Um, I told y'all I'm intermittent fasting, right? So we had the pizza party, so I ate a couple of hours earlier than what I normally would. I ate around noon instead of two, so I lose a couple of hours tonight and... To be honest with you, I had two slices of pizza and uh, one chocolate chip cookie and some salad. And I'm so full. Like, I'm still full. Like, I don't want to eat anything. Like, I'm not hungry. Which is one of the reasons why I try to only bring snacks with me when I'm intermittent fasting. Because, like, today I had in my bag some grapes, a banana, crackers, and cheese. And some chocolate covered almonds. That was going to be, like, something that I munched on all day so that I wouldn't be full you know, after two, but, um, so that way I can eat dinner with Earl, but I don't know. We'll, we'll see. And, and the thing is, I probably won't get hungry until late and I'm, and I have a cutoff time, um, at like eight o'clock. So hopefully I'll eat before then if I get hungry or whatever, but you know, it is what it is. Can't be perfect every day, right? All right, guys, I'm going to cut it short today. Only three minutes and some, I'm like four minutes talking to you guys. Usually I'm just going on and on and on. But um, we're doing really well on the count. Guys, thank you so much for 
watch my videos and just letting it run. I really appreciate it. But I'm going to get off from here now and I'm going to go in the kitchen and do my cooking. And then I'm going to get myself in the shower, pick out what I'm wearing for work, and then I'm going to try to rest. All right. So I'll see y'all on Thursday. Bye. Hey, y'all. It's Thursday. Thursday. I don't have a song for Thursday. All I have is hump day. That is it. Hump day. So. I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing today. Speaking of what I'm wearing today, really, really fast. If you want sneak peeks of what I'm wearing in real time, go to Style by Darkberry on Instagram. Because some days, not every day, but some days, I take pictures of what I'm wearing and I post it. So you can kind of be ahead of the curve and... If it's something that you feel like you want to wear, you know, you got a little bit of inspiration. So I'm going to try to be more mindful and posting some of these outfits on Style by Darkberry. And I don't know if I should post them in real time. Yeah, I'm going to post them in real time. Y'all have a, you know, but then you come here, I can tell you where I've got some of these pieces, you know. So like the Nikes, I think I ordered them a long time. I know, I can tell you the year, 2017. Because I was in bed, I just had my hysterectomy, and I had nothing to do, so I started shopping online. And I think that's where I got these online somewhere. Like, I don't know if, I don't know if I got these from Amazon. Child, I can't tell you. I think Amazon or something like that, but bought these. Um, these are like from Burlington, these pants. They're kind of like jogging pants. I just kind of rolled them up at the bottom, giving it a more sporty look. And then, again, um, just like, um, what was it, Monday? Monday or Tuesday, I had wore all black with the brown tank top. This is also one of those same tank tops from Walmart. And then my my trusty Costco blue jean jacket. I like this jacket because it's not real thick. It's kind of lightweight. It's it's stretchy as well. Um, so that's kind of why I like it. Um, and then it's kind of it's very casual, very casual. So yeah, so this is my outfit today. It's Thursday, y'all know. Y'all know me on Thursdays, honey. The, <laughs> the closer it gets to Friday, the more casual I get. So, tomorrow I may try to film myself in the morning because I know we have somewhere to go. Well, no, that's right. Earl will be home tomorrow. Oh, gosh. I'm going to put my hand in my pocket. I still got my badge from work. Um, Earl will work from home, so I, I will be able to come home and film my outfit of the day before we head out because we got somewhere to go tomorrow. So, yeah. But, um... This is it, honey. This is the outfit of the day. I got on the my other Michael Kors, loop, Michael Kors loops. Um, I wore these today, and then I went on and put my second. Just a, um, I think I got these in. No, not Belize. In Honduras, I think that's where I got this. These um, silver little balls here, right here, and then. Um, Makeup, I did more, let me see so y'all can see a little bit better maybe. Let me see, is it, no, I think I need to go brighter maybe. Um, that's too bright. But, y'all hear y'all friend? <laughs> Hold on, I know y'all probably like, where is Chef? Chefy, baby, hi. You wanna come and be on the video? You wanna come see the people? You want to say hi? Come here. Yeah, come here so everybody can see you. Chef, come over here. That belt is not bothering you. Come here. Say hi to everybody. Can y'all see him? Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. God, I love this sea line. <laughs> Always messing with the back scratcher. So anyway, um, what was I saying? Um, makeup hair. Oh yeah, I wanted y'all to see. Like I really put on a bold, like kind of, kind of more bold as far as the eyes. Let me see if y'all can see. Them. But yeah, and then y'all, I want to get permanent. <laughs> what? You want me to pick you up? Let 
there he is. There's the pretty kitty. Oh, you wanna get down? Look, you gotta say hi. Hi. Okay, put you down. Um, yeah. I keep forgetting what I'm saying, chef. You keep distracting me. Eyebrows. I wanna get these permanent. I think they cost a lot. And then I need to go and get some lashes. So I wanna just, oh God. That's the one reason I hate picking him up. I've been giving him grain-free food so that he don't shed so much. Oh my God, I cannot. Like, I brush him, I brush him. I'm always like, I'm very diligent. <laughs> like, with there's certain things that he know he cannot get on. I don't, Earl picks him up a lot. I do not like picking him up because I don't know. I just have this thing with hair. I don't like it. I don't like it, so. So y'all need to tell me what I need to do for these eyebrows. Somewhere I can get them that's not so expensive. Because y'all know I love a bargain. But I also need to go run an errand really fast. I need to go return something to uh, Amazon. It's something for my um, Blackstone. And then I need to go to CVS and pick up some medication. And um, get some stuff for my hair. I always do like these care passes. I think it's what it's called at CVS. And I get five dollars every month or whatever, so um, I like to when I go in there use it, get my money or whatever. I think it rolls over. I'm not sure. I need to ask them if it rolls over. So anyway, guys, that is it. This is my outfit today. This is it. Jewelry, same stuff, nothing different. Um, y'all need to tell me how I can um, switch up these outfit days. Unless y'all are good with just seeing what I'm wearing, the ideas. I know some people actually do videos dedicated to like hey you know different ideas like how you can wear a dress you know or how can you you know how you can your clothes can look more expensive how you dress on a budget and all that kind of stuff I'm just showing you what I wear to work from day to day so this is like more of a professional outfits um, for work for business attire um, mainly for I guess you want to say women over 50 or 40 40 and above, something like that. Because, you know, your girl turned 53. So, yeah. Thank the Lord for that. And, y'all, guess what's coming up? It was inevitable it was going to come up. I used to share, and I still do, share this month for birthdays with my mama. I was always August 4th. And she was always August 27 and see I just I just days just just that fast I'm dazing off because last year you know I took stuff over she was in the bed she wasn't feeling too good but I remember taking stuff to my mom and now I can take stuff to my mom this year so I know people always say got your mama here give her extra hugs extra love but I loved my mom, all my siblings did, and we showed her that we loved her. Y'all, it's still, you you still gonna miss them. Like, I mean, I'm telling you to go hug them because I don't have my mom here to hug, but that ain't gonna do nothing for you. I mean, you know what I mean? And it's not gonna do nothing for me because I still don't have my mama. Uh, but I used to always kind of live from day to day with my mom thinking about this exact time that, you know, one day ain't going to have her. And it still didn't prepare me. Like, it still didn't. Like, last year I did what a daughter does. You know, I took her gifts and we sat in bed with her and talked with her. You know, trimmed her toenails, all the stuff. Me and my brother was, like, trimming her toenails and, you know. We all got to go down this path, which sucks. I mean, after my mom passed, all I keep thinking about is when I'm going to pass. I do not want my kids feeling this. But this is how I know God is good. Because if anybody can get through this, my goodness, like, oh, 
God is God's got to be good because this is hard. This can be very hard. But to say that you go on to see another day and to live another day and to laugh and to make other memories and sometimes I feel I don't know. Y'all tell me this if y'all lost your mom and if you have my condolences because it's hard. But do you ever like at the beginning when after you lost her like you know within the year and probably even beyond when you would laugh at something like when I'm with Kayla and we're laughing and we're having a good time sometimes I feel guilty I really feel guilty like or yeah I feel guilty or I I just miss her even more like dang it used to be me, her, and Kayla. You know, like we used to get on the FaceTime thing together and just crack up. Or we talk about hair, or we talk about makeup, or we talk about clothes, or we just talk about silly stuff. And I miss that. And so I have that with Kayla, but then it's like a missing link on my side. But then I have to make sure that I'm the mother to Kayla that I wanted my mama to be to me while she was here. I, I can't shortchange Kayla or Jordan. I won't do that. I don't want to do that. I want to be that and even more to them. So, anyway, I didn't mean to make everything go down. But y'all tell me what you think. I, I mentioned eyebrows, eyelashes, your mama laughing, feeling guilty, her birthday, all the things. So, anyway, um, are we going to do something? I think the boys are planning something. Whatever it is, I just don't want it to be sad. Because mama, for sure. Y'all remember my mama. Mama, for sure, was not a sad person. She just wasn't. Mama was silly, outlandish, bold. Why do I hear thunder? I need to go run my air. I'm going to just sit up here and Maybe that was my mama. Maybe that was my mom. Hey, mama. That's so cool. God is so good. Didn't I just say God is good? He is so good. I'm sitting up here talking about my mama. Did I hear thunder? Y'all, we ain't had a lick of rain. They said we got uh, some rain like a couple of days ago. I think it was a Tuesday. We got some rain. And they said it was all of five minutes. But I ain't heard no thunder in a long time. That's pretty cool. Y'all are witnesses. I hope y'all can hear it. Y'all are witnesses to that. God is good. All right. So now, see how God works. He's get, get a little pep in my step now. I can I can move on a little longer. I can go on a little bit longer now. All right, guys. Bye. Well, hello, y'all. It is Friday, and I guess y'all probably say that it's not a casual outfit, but for me it is. This dress is so comfortable. Thrifted. Got on my trusty shoes. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You've been around long enough. Got these from Marshalls. If I find these again, I'm buying them because I just love them. I, I don't know. They're very, you know, ladylike or whatever you want to say. <laughs> but anyway, guys, um, I'm coming to you with an outfit of the day. It is Friday. Um, I think I'm going to start ending my outfit of the days on Friday. It just makes more sense so I can go ahead and get these videos up for you guys. So I'm just going to do professional week of outfits basically going to work and stuff like that and so this is what i decided to wear today to work and it was so super comfortable and i'm glad i was comfortable today because y'all can see my mood for friday it should be a little bit higher but i thank god for a job thank god that people need me to do stuff oh wee it was a lot <laughs> i actually worked a little overtime actually a lot of overtime because i didn't even take lunch today i worked right through it and speaking of that, I need to eat because I keep feeling lightheaded because I did not, um, I just snacked on a couple of crackers and some almonds and whatever, excuse me, was in our candy bowl, which I know I shouldn't even be doing that, but I needed something in my stomach. So I'm gonna probably grab a granola bar because we're getting ready to go and see the in-laws and they're gonna feed us and I am providing dessert. So it should be a lovely evening um, with them. And, um, but yeah, like I was in the store and I felt lightheaded because yeah but and it's not like this every day just today because i worked all the way through lunch but having said all that intermittent fasting is working got on the scale last night six and a half pounds down y'all since monday and it's friday 
hey, if y'all want me to tell y'all what I'm doing, I will. I can make a video about that. As a matter of fact, maybe I'll just go ahead and put up a video about that, about what I have done and what I see that I can do. And then, you know, maybe I can give y'all some type of, you know, information. But anyway, this is my makeup. It's the, it's the norm. You know, I didn't do anything really different. Maybe a little bit darker here in the eye, in the crease there. But that's about it. Lipstick still on because, like I said, all I had was crackers and almonds. And <laughs> But I'm ready to eat. I am ready to eat, so I'm going to go ahead and jump off. But this is it. This is all my jewelry. I wore these today. Y'all, yesterday, the wind picked up like crazy yesterday. And parts of the city said they did get rain. We didn't get any rain. Um, the kids' electricity went out. Like, when I mentioned Mama Baby, it just, the weather went crazy, didn't it? And speaking of her, these, this set here is something I bought her last year for her birthday. And her birthday is Sunday. And, uh, yeah. And so I'm wearing them. These are actually hers. I actually have a set like this myself. But she always kept admiring them. I, oh, I love your earrings. And I, I bought her some. And she really didn't, she didn't wear them, y'all. I found them, went through, went through her stuff, and they were still in the box. So, it is what it is. <laughs> But I bought these for my mama, and I'm going to wear them in honor of her this weekend and stuff like that. So that is it, y'all. Oh, I think y'all's friend is here. Do y'all see him? No, I don't see him. Do. Let's see. Hey, Chef. I'm sorry. He in the middle of his own bag. Hey. How are you? Oh, he ain't doing so good. I guess you know we're getting ready to leave. Is that what it is? You know we're getting ready to leave? And I just got home, mommy. Just got home, huh? I just got home because Earl worked from home today. So, this is a good angle. You guys can see everything. Chef, it's because of you. If they, if the people got a good angle. So, like, you guys can see the entire outfit, the dress and everything. Like I said, it's very big and blousey. It's not form fitting at all, but I love it. All right, guys. So this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed um, the five days of the week for um, my outfits, professional outfits, but also casual at the same time. So kind of like business casual too. Um, so what I do for a living, I'm an executive administrative assistant. So you'll kind of get the gist of what I'm wearing. I still try not to dress for my role, but try to sometimes dress up. Sometimes, you know, I just want to be comfortable, y'all. So anyway, thank you again for um, tuning in. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Like I told you, everything over here is a budget. So go ahead and subscribe because it's absolutely free. And I want y'all to share my video with somebody. Share share my video with somebody you love. Like one of your girlfriends or one of your guy friends. You're like, I think y'all will like her because this is what she does. Da, 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 da. So go ahead and share. And... Um, I always say, why not share? Because sharing is caring, and my name is Karen, so why wouldn't you share? Huh? All right, so I will talk to you guys later. Have a fabulous rest of your week, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Well, hey, guys. It's me, Darkberry32. And today is Monday, and I got my Monday over with, and y'all know how I feel when I get my Monday over with, honey. But you know what? This Monday went by pretty, pretty, super, super fast. But anyway, I wanted to say welcome to Darkberry32 on this channel. Yeah, I've been vlogging and doing all kinds of stuff forever on this channel. So hello and welcome if you're here. And I just want to let you know what you're going to find on Darkberry32. You're going to find cooking, cleaning, DIYing, decor, thrifting on a budget, everything. I mean, vlogging, outfit of the days, which is probably why you're here. So yeah, all that type of stuff. And then I do outfits for particularly for myself, but you know, women that's like over 40, they're like in the professional realm of things, you know? So sometimes you're going to find professional, you're going to find uh, business, business casual, those types of things here on this channel. But before I get started in what I'm wearing, I have my daughter on the phone. Kayla, can you say hi? Hi. <laughs> so, yes. Yeah, so, Kayla um, just started um, her new career. She is a third grade teacher. This is her first year teaching. And a lot of you guys helped um, her, like, get her room all together with different types of equipment and office supply, uh, all kinds of supplies and stuff like that. So, 
Um, she said she wanted to do a special shout out, so she's on the phone, and I thought I'd put it up there so y'all can hear her, hear it personally from her. Um, thank you to Iris, Ingrid, Nicole, and Sasha Monique Talk. Thank you so much for helping me and getting some of the stuff. We actually used a lot of the stuff that you guys bought um, this week and last week. So, what are some of the things that you got to some of the other people that are listening um, know? Um, I got some headphones, um, the multiplication slide table, so that helped them today. Oh, cool. Um, goldfish, some different snacks, and uh, paper towels. Yeah, so she got a lot, a little bit of everything. I think she got even some granola bars and stuff like that. So that was pretty cool. And if you haven't seen that, I did post a picture on my community page here on YouTube. So yeah, um, she was really excited about that. And you guys, that, that almost brought tears to my eyes because that shows how long we've been on YouTube. And for you guys to say like, oh my God, I remember when Kayla was going to dance class for the first time and all that kind of stuff. And now she has her own classroom. I thought that was super cool. And I cannot thank you guys enough. Kayla, I'm sure is very happy about all the stuff that you guys gave her. So I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Um, if you still, um, Kayla, do you still have things on your list? Yes, I do. Okay. So probably what I'll do is in this, um, on this video in the description box, I'll put, um, her Amazon list. And if you guys feel like you want to just, you know, I mean, it could be something little, it don't have to be anything big. Um, do you know some of the things that you have on the list? Um, I just have like some little stuffed animals for like their treasure box. Cause we'll be doing some prizes. Um, at the end of the two weeks, mm -hmm. um, I can't even remember anything else, okay. but there's like little small stuff in there. Yeah. So if you guys want to like contribute in that way, that would be great. Any little thing helps because y'all know Kayla was unemployed before this. Um, she still has not gotten her first check yet. <laughs> So she's still trying to make it on the little money she has. And of course, with the help of you guys, it helps a lot. And of course, I've helped and her dad has helped. So, you know, she's got a lot of family members that have helped as well. So we really appreciate it so a lot. Let me just get on with this outfit of the day and then I can continue to talk to her and get downstairs and put dinner on. So I got this dress from Old Navy a long time ago and decided to go ahead and don it today. And I really am glad that I did. I think it's a really perfect dress for the summer. Nice periwinkle color. And then I decided to um, pair it with this Hermes belt. Now I did tell y'all I do things on the budget so y'all know this is a knockoff. <laughs> It's a knockoff and I got it I think in Mexico when I was on a cruise or something like that And then I paired it with a pair of my favorite one of my favorite pairs of shoes um, Yeah, I can't even tell you the name of them because I've been wearing them so long But I got these I think from like Burlington or something like that But I think it goes really well with the belt and stuff. So yeah, it was a very relaxed um, type of an outfit and then you know the wedge here you can't go wrong with the wedge I don't know, it's an easy shoe to wear. I'm going to go ahead and keep them off. And then um, here's my jewelry. I just went on and decided to wear the gold loops. And, you know, that way it fed off of the H in the Hermes belt. And, yeah, that. And then just my regular jewelry and stuff like that. So, yeah, for the rest of the week, though, I will be wearing jeans because we're moving from one floor to another. And then I'm going to have to move again in January, which makes no sense. But... I will start, you know, you'll probably see me in the rest of the week in jeans, except for Wednesday. Wednesday, I will be working from home and, you know, all the good stuff and then go back to work on Thursday. And then I think I'll be working from home on Friday as well. So, yeah, that is it, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Now, let's get on to Tuesday. Bye. Tell them bye, Kayla. Bye. <laughs> bye, y'all. What's up, guys? It's me, Darkberry32, and... Kayla. <laughs> She's on the phone again, guys, because we got two more packages. And she wanted to come on here and thank whoever bought them. Kayla, who are you thanking today? Angela Mauer. All right. Thank you so much, Angela. Angela was a co-worker of mine back in the day, and she faithfully watches Darkberry32. And she loves our cat, Chef over here she's always commenting um about chef so thank you angela so much for helping kayla 
you know, you guys are investing in her future as a teacher. When you guys help her, she can help her, uh, her students and stuff. So this is really, really cool. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you again, Angela, for doing that. You'll also be, before you see this, you'll get a text from me because I still have your number in my phone. All right. <laughs> All right, guys. So this today, um, I went really casual. Didn't do any movement, but I still went casual today. Um, I have on my Skechers here, uh, Levi, Levi 712, I think. I think that's the number. I'm not sure. And then just this shirt that I got from thrift store. First time wearing it. Had it for a while in the closet. Just couldn't figure out what I was going to wear with it. But this was very simple, easy. Pull it right out of the closet. Tomorrow I'll be working from home. So not sure if you're getting an outfit there day or not. I've eaten up all my lipstick off of my lips. <laughs> so this is what you see. This is my hair. The curls are tied up and kind of messing with it, pulling on it. That's probably why you see product in it. But, yeah, this is it. And I'm not even going to turn around in the back, honey, because I fell asleep in the car while Earl was driving. My hair was just, like, bobbing and weaving. I'm really sleepy. But I'm going to go downstairs, cook some dinner, um, and all those good things. And it's great because I don't have to go in tomorrow. And I'm off Friday, y'all. So I may end up filming Thursday and then just going ahead and giving y'all one big video on Friday um, for this week. All right. So I will talk to you guys later. Thank you again. Bye.